What part of what you do as a theoretical physicist only made possible, enabled by your physical embodiment? Um, well, my physical embodiment in my brain. So the way I look at it is that I am a computer program. I, in other words, I'm an abstraction. Um, I am not the brain. The brain is just the hardware on which I am running. But I am software. I am therefore embodied in the brain. If I were embodied in something else with the same computing power, then I would be embodied in that. And if it didn't have the rest of the body, like the arms and legs and so on, then that, that would be equivalent to being in a sensory deprivation tank. But a person in a sensory deprivation tank is still exactly as much of a person as when they're outside. And, you know, if you lose a limb, you don't say, I'm less of a person now, or I'm saying that metaphorically. <laughs> You're not you're not uh, less entitled to the vote or less entitled to human rights if you, if you lose an arm. Um, and I, I think the same is true of the brain. That is, what counts in the brain is the running program. That's what is conscious, that's what has feelings, and that's what is embodied. <laughs>